Cold case solved decades after a man is beaten to death in Providence. Police say they have the person responsible in custody tonight. It's our top local story at 6. Eyewitness News reporter Marilyn Chair joins us live from outside the Providence Public Safety Complex with more on how the arrest came about. Well, police say this was one of 31 unsolved cases back in 1990. And the victim's family had wondered for all these years what had happened to this loved one. And now with this latest development, they have some closure. 27 Somerset Street in Providence back on February 24th, 1990, is where police say a man was beaten to death in a vacant third floor apartment. It was a cold case for nearly 24 years until Friday evening. That's when police say a homeless man walked into the police station and confessed to killing 32-year-old Michael Holliday in South Providence, a man he said he didn't intend to kill. Police say 65-year-old Daniel Serrano told police his conscience and guilt is what made him come clean about the murder. Detectives brought Serrano back to the Somerset location, and police say he told them details about the crime no one else could know. Eyewitness News went to the Providence home of Holiday's sister, but no one was there. Teresa Holiday Delves told our partners at the Providence Journal the confession was the best gift ever. Serrano, who is known to police and has a history of arrests for drugs and breaking and entering, was arraigned before a bail commissioner on murder charges Saturday morning. And once again, police say that Serrano told them that he meant to go after another man who was harassing him and that Holiday was not the person he intended to kill. And police say it was very difficult to tell the family of Holiday that essentially he was killed for nothing. Reporting live with the Providence Mobile Newsroom, Marilyn Shera, Eyewitness News.